Coverage you can count on continues with a pinball tournament in South Carolina. Isabella Moody has a look at how people of all ages came out for a fun time. If you need a way to flip a gloomy day around, Radioactive Pinball Arcade is having its summer meltdown tournament and is a jackpot for players from different areas to come and play. People, I think, have the uh, perception that maybe it's only for people that are experts at and we'll have 10-year-old uh, you know, uh, girls in there, you know what I mean? It, it's, it's just fun. It's friendly competition. Everybody's so supportive uh, that it's just, it's just a fun day. It's like playing a, a round of golf with your buddies. Sunday's tournament at Radioactive Pinball in Aiken was a chance for a little indoor fun on a hot summer day. Since COVID, pinball has become more popular and more are starting to play. This is his favorite place to play, hands down, anywhere he's ever played. So whenever there's anything that's uh, a bigger tournament over here, their launch parties for their new machines, those types of things, we always make the trip. He's just really excited to be among, among in his element. Donna Liptak and her 15-year-old son travel from Charleston, South Carolina, for him to be in pinball tournaments. He is 30 youth in the world. But few know of a law on the books in South Carolina that actually bans kids under age 18 from playing. A law State Representative Bill Taylor says needs to go. A bill to repeal the law passed the State House in 2024 but died in the Senate. This is an archaic law that burdens small businesses. It needs to be tossed. We'll try again next legislative session. And that old law isn't stopping parents from passing their love of this game down to their kids. From the time that he could actually reach across the pinball machine, that's when he's been, you know, he started playing. And uh, I've been playing since I was three with my father, and uh, we're kind of just passing this along. You know, we're doing this together. For more information on Radioactive Pinball Arcade and the tournaments they hold, you can find that on WJBF.com. In Aiken, Isabella Moody, WJBF News Channel 6.